What is up pips with you, I'm the Gaps, and I'm finally back with another video. Although this video is kinda useless for people without a creator code, I will teach you how to make a text that switches every 5 seconds on the top left of the screen of your maps, so you can share your socials or creator code for example, and it will certainly help you growing. As I want to come back with my YouTube channel, maps and whatever, I decided to make this tutorial because it can be helpful for some people and it is content. Also want to remember you to subscribe to my YouTube channel and my social medias which are all in the description and to play my maps obviously. As you can see there are 5 tracker devices and 5 triggers. I decided to just show you the settings of these devices instead of setting them up with you because their settings are kinda confusing but I will explain everything as well. Each one of these tracker devices has a different message, this one says my creator code, this one says my YouTube, this one says my Instagram, my Twitter and my Dropnight account. First of all, an asterisk before each setting means that I change something on it. Please put everything just like me, even if I don't explain what each option does. Choose the tracker title and the description, it does need to be use code I'm the gaps, it can be just an info about the map or whatever you want. Turn off show progress so there won't be a counter on the text like 0 slash 10 and remove when receiving from channel 100. You can also put a sign when receiving from channel 96, but just if you're going to do the same amount of trackers as me. This will be the channel transmitted by the last trigger device, so if you're going to do with less devices, put here the channel that the last device is transmitting from. Setting up the trigger device now and the setting is one of the most important. Set it to activate on game start and choose the delay. The delay is basically the duration of last tracker's message. This means that the trigger will transmit 5 seconds after the game starts and will turn off the use code tracker to activate the next one and trigger another trigger with 5 seconds of delay. This is optional but as I won't need VFX and don't want random noises from the triggers I will turn them off. Enable on game start or it won't work and enable and trigger when receiving from from channel 96 or the channel transmitted by the last device. This is what will create a loop because this first trigger will be triggered again by the last one and transmit on channel 100. This is just a copy of the first tracker device but we will change the assign and remove channels, the text and super important, don't assign on game start. Change the text. I decided to put YouTube as the second text displaying, so it will pop 5 seconds after the 5 initial seconds displaying my creator code, but you can put whatever you want. Now you'll change the assign channels from 96 or the channel transmitted by the last device on your system to 100 and the remove channels from 100 to 99. Again, this is just a copy of the first trigger device but with a few changes. To work, we should switch activate in game phase from game start to none. Enabled on game start is not really important, but you should enable it to avoid any problems. Enable when receiving from channel 100, trigger when receiving from channel 100, and when triggered transmit on channel 99. From now, you'll only need to change receiving and transmission channel from each device and their texts. I will speed up the video, but please pay attention. Now, on the final trigger, this is the last channel, channel 96. If you're doing this just with 4 triggers, for example, the last channel will be 97, so you'll need to change the channels which first trigger and first tracker are receiving signal from. Remember that the last tracker is also receiving signal from the last channel, channel 96. If you're using less devices, do not forget to check every device. Starting the game to show you and it's working. As you can see, the text on the top left of the screen will be swapping every 5 seconds with a different text. If you want to know how to make something like this with every social on the same text, I recommend you to watch text's tutorial, the link will be on the description. 
If you need help making this system with less devices, I will put here a clip so you can understand better how to do it. Thanks for watching, I hope it helped you and if it did, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and leave a like. See ya!